A word of the day. A word of the day comes from Psalms 121, verses 5 and 6. And it says, the Lord is your keeper. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun shall not strike you by day, nor the moon by night. Praise the Lord. One more time. The Lord is your keeper. The Lord is your shade at your right hand. The sun shall not strike you by day, nor the moon by night. Praise the Lord. I think these verses are just truly telling us that the Lord is truly with us all. He will not let our enemies take over us. He will protect us. He got us. There's no need to stress or worry or be afraid of anything or anyone or at all. In Genesis 28, 15, it says, Behold, I am with you, and I will keep you wherever you go. I will bring you back to this land. I will not leave you until I have done what I have spoken to you. Praise the Lord. I am with you, and I will keep you. Praise. Remember those words today. The Lord says, I am with you wherever you go. So there's no need to fear anyone. There's no need to be stressed or worried because the Lord truly has us. He sees everything and knows everything. He knows our going in and our coming out and our going in. He knows it all. And we know that he keeps his promises. In Psalms 91 verses 1 and 2, and it says, he who dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. This is us. We, we, we dwell in the place where the Lord is, the shadow of the Almighty. We abide in him. We connect with him. We are with him, and he is with us. I will say to I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God, in him I will trust. Amen to that. He is He helps us in our times of trouble. He writes the wrongs of those that have done evil against us. He protects us from the wicked. He foils the plots of those that persecute us. The Lord is with us all, and we should all remember that today. The plans of the enemies will not prosper. The word tells us truly. For those who put their trust and their faith in the Lord, with our whole hearts, truly, God is with us all. In Isaiah 49, 10, it says, They shall neither hunger nor thirst. Nor heat nor sun shall strike them. For he who has mercy on them will lead them. Even by the springs of water, he will guide them. Amen. Nothing will come near us. The Lord was truly, truly will take care of each and every one of us. And we have to remember that. Does that mean things are going to be perfect? No, it doesn't mean that at all. But it means we have a savior and we have an activate that's going to provide for us and lead us and direct us and bless us all. In Revelation 7, verses 16 and 17, it says, They shall neither hunger anymore nor thirst anymore. The sun shall not strike them nor any heat. For the lamb who is in the midst of the throne will shepherd them and lead them to living fountains of water. And God will walk and God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. Praise the Lord. 
Every knee will bow. The Lord is truly on our side today. And we to remember that today. He is in the midst of us. He fills us with this fountain of water. He fills us with his spirit. So there is truly nothing for us to be afraid of. Praise the Lord. Amen. Heavenly Father, we thank you for these words today. We thank you for just reminding us that you have us. Excuse me. That you have us in the palm of your hands. You're going to give us the future and the hope that you promised. You're going to take care of us. You will bless us. We are yours and you are ours. So help us today to walk in your spirit. Help us today to remember these words. Excuse me. Help us to see and understand that you got us. You will never leave us nor forsake us. You are always here for us in our times of troubles. When those who persecute us, when those who are suffering that we go through, the troubles that we may have, we know that you're going to take care of each and every one of us. So we just thank you for that, and we just continue to lift you up. Bless us all today. Give us your strength today, and fill us with your Holy Spirit today. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you all peace today. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. God bless you all. Have a wonderful day in the Lord.